Thanks, Noel. Uh, good morning, everybody. I'm delighted to be here to join you to represent the Department of Further Higher Education, Research, Innovation and Science uh, on behalf of the Minister. I'm also pleased to have this opportunity to celebrate 10 years of insight, the SFI Research Centre for Data Analytics. Um, it's interesting that the department is only three years old, but the centre is 10 years old, but I think that probably reflects uh, ministerial appointments rather than anything else. Special uh, thank you to Noel O'Connor for inviting us, and also we're delighted to be joined by uh, Professor Philip Nolan from Science Foundation Ireland. As you know, Insight is one of the network of world-leading SFI research centres undertaking research and supporting innovation in areas of strategic importance to Ireland, with a focus on developing talent and new knowledge, while also bringing excellent researchers in our higher education institutions together to collaborate with industry. The SFI research centres are supporting the deliver, delivery of transformative research discovery and innovation across our HEIs, while also providing key training of students with critical in-demand skills, enhancing enterprise and industry, whilst also supporting regional development and boosting Ireland's international reputation. I'm delighted to hear today about the achievements of the Inside SFI Research Centre and look forward to the presentations later on. The SFI Research Centre model was designed to bring together research excellence from across the country and across disciplines, enabling us to compete at scale. I believe from the evidence of the Insight Centre's economic report that this achievement has been successfully delivered. Partnership is at the heart of the SFI Research Centres. SFI works in collaboration with many government departments, including the IDA Ireland, Enterprise Ireland and also the HEA. Centres like Insight also provide import, important input and advice into government and EU policy. In fact, independent studies have shown this to be true. You may be aware of a, a recent University of Limerick study which was published in 2022 in the journal Research Policy, which was led by Professor Helene Lenehan, which analysed the value of the publicly funded SFI Research Centres programme. It found that companies that collaborate with the centres tend to increase their investment in R&D and also redirect their R&D expenditure towards more scientific types of research. The study found that the SFI Research Centre's programme has led to greater potential for breakthrough ideas and disruptive innovations, thereby boosting the Irish economy, making it more competitive and resilient. Insight's own report, which is published today, also confirms the value of the centre, and we look forward to further details of that. Perhaps just a reflection on the SFI Research Centre programme, which is part of um, Pillar 3 of the new uh, Research and Innovation Strategy Impact 2030. Uh, there is a commitment there to, to look at the progress of research centres. We welcome uh, SFI doing this and looking at the, the design of these centres. SFI has engaged in a cross-agency departmental consultation exercise to garner feedback on the development of the new SFI Researcher Centre programme with a view to launching a new open funding call for proposals later this year. We are progressing many areas of Impact 2030, including the new Research and Innovation Bill, and work is underway to appoint a government science advisor. I congratulate all of the researcher teams, the partners involved in the Insight SFI Research Centre, and wish you every success with your future research programmes. Thank you. <laughs> 